Bye. This video is going to be all about how I hate school and why I don't like it. Um, the first reason is that I have to get up at 7am every morning. Um, I mean, let's be real, that doesn't happen. What I mean by that is I set an alarm for 7am, ignore it because I don't want to get up. And I somehow think in my head that if I ignore it, it will just never turn back on again and I won't have to go to school. Unfortunately, that's not the case. I then end up having a 10 past 7 alarm set. I turn that off. My 20 past 7 alarm goes off. I turn that off. At this point, I'm probably starting to wake up. I'm a bit groggy. And then I probably stay on my phone till about 20 to 8. I need to leave at 20 past 8. So I have 40 minutes. So I'm like, okay, you know what? I probably could do this. It never happens. I end up getting in the shower. I have a quick 10 minute shower. You might think that's really long, but I like showers. And also this hair, I don't know why. It just takes forever to wash. And the quickest shower I ever did was in like seven minutes. Anyway, I completely lose all track of time in the shower. I end up getting out of the shower, usually around about eight o'clock, maybe five past eight. And then I panic. And then I have to put my shoes on, put my uniform on. Yes, I have to put uniform on because I go to British public school. I don't even get the joy when you go back to school. I don't even get the joy of picking out my own outfit. Anyway, basically I never end up getting out of the house at 20 past 8. And almost every single day, I am late. I'm always the last one into tutor. The second reason I don't like school. <sighs> there's, a, there's a lot of kids. There's over a thousand students in my school. Which can sometimes be a bit of an issue. I hate. Hate. With a big passion, I hate school corridors. They really irritate me. There's always those people who shove through everyone else. I hate them. I always get squished up against the side of the wall. I always end up tramping on some year seven and go, Oh my god, I'm so sorry, it's not my fault. Because it's genuinely not my fault. The kid behind me's fault. I also get really claustrophobic and like start to panic a bit. I, I really hate school corridors. That thing, 80% of the stuff that I learn in school, I actually know. 90% of the stuff I learn in school, I don't remember when I go home. I will have a conversation with my family at dinner and we'll go, okay, so what do you have today? I go, you know what? I actually don't know. And I have to think what I had first period, second, third, fourth, even fifth, which I only had probably like three hours ago. It's not good. I just, I, I don't even remember what class I have, let alone what I learned in those classes. <laughs> Please say you can relate because that will be really awkward if you don't relate, actually. What am I saying? Um, um, I had a point. I did have a point. It's gone. Hold on, let me think about this a second. I got it. Okay, so in my school, you are assigned a seat. You can't just sit wherever you want. You can't sit near your friends. I, okay, I'm one of those people. I have to talk in class. I'm sorry. I can't just sit back and do my work. I have to talk to the person next to me. I have to make conversations because that's the only way I can survive school. I, I just, oh my God. I have to go back tomorrow as well. Fine, we're gonna get through a bit. You only have like what? Three more years left of it? I hate it when you have to sit next to someone who you don't like, who you just have nothing in common with, and you both hate each other. Anyway, I also hate the fact that you are thrown in to this social situation. I guarantee 80% of the people who are in your class, in your school, you probably don't care about, you really don't like, and you don't ever want to see again. There's so many different personalities and so many different people that are forced to work together every single day. You're forced to see these people every single day. And I don't want to see these people every single day. I know that's quite mean to say, but it's the truth. So, that's the tea. Oh my God, I can't believe I just said that. I don't like it because you can't leave. You can't go, you can't just get up and walk out. Oh my God, my eye. My eye just like twitched for no reason. I was like, I don't know what's happening. I thought I was dying. What am I even doing with this video? What am I doing with my life? Wow, that's a deep question. Why are we on the earth? Are we like a big accident? Are we supposed to do something? Deep thoughts with Laurie. Those are the reasons I really don't like school. And also I get 
please tell me if you can relate to this. I get an absurd amount of hand cramps. I have to write with a pen, right? Pretty much every single lesson. Your hand is in... I don't want this pen. But let's have this fun and fresh pencil. With a little policeman on it. This guy cramps your hand up like mad. I can't hold a pencil. I hold a pencil like... Why can't I hold a pen? I haven't been to school for two weeks. It's like Christmas break, right? You hold a pencil for almost six hours every day. It <laughs> Hand cramps hurt, dude. They really... I just... I... I... I'm disintegrating. Oh my legs. Oh 